Amadeus Mozart, the famous composer, believed that he had been poisoned in the weeks before he died. And he might have been right, but not for the reasons he thought. See, Mozart suffered all kinds of health problems during his life, including rheumatic fever, typhus, and chronic renal failure in his final years. And while Mozart's doctors said that he died from some kind of bacterial infection, he also suffered from swollen feet and hands, pale skin, kidney damage, and often fainted, which matched the symptoms of poisoning by the element antimony. Now, he probably wasn't poisoned maliciously, but accidentally. Mozart tended to use patent medicines. Loosely regulated secret recipes with barely any medicinal benefit. Mozart likely would have been prescribed a popular patent medicine at the time that contained antimony for the fever that he experienced during his final days. But since nobody performed an autopsy, we're stuck with competing ideas of what he died with as opposed to what he died from. 